Hey, what's going on, guys? What's up? Ace here. And today we're going to be reacting to the Nintendo Switch Direct for 9 13 of 2018. Now, I'm not really expecting too terribly much from this Direct. Um, they're straying away. I actually, one thing that I hope they do is they stray away from Smash. Um, the past couple directs, obviously the last one was Smash related, but the E3 presentation was practically all Smash related. So I'm hoping to see some new games. Maybe uh, we'll see um, Yoshi, maybe some Metroid Prime. Um, I'm honestly thinking there's going to be something on Luigi's Mansion because for whatever reason, Luigi's um, uh, vacuum... I can't remember the name. Look different. So I'm assuming they're making a uh, Luigi's Mansion 3 or maybe another remake for the Switch. Um, as for maybe some characters for Smash, maybe Shadow, a Pokemon rep, or I don't know, um, Dixie Kong. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Um, I'm hoping to see some more games because I, as much as I love Smash... I'd like to see some different games. So without further ado, let's watch this stuff. How do we get things? This is spooky already. Oh, <laughs> hey, look at that. It's Luigi. It's a new Luigi's Mansion. Oh my God, that looks good. What? Yeah, this new... Oh, I called it, baby! I called it! 2019. Maybe a Halloween release? Ohayou gozaimasu. I probably said that wrong. Oh, I should turn my light on so I'm not as red. There we go. We kick things off with a new reveal. And I'm pleased to confirm that Luigi's next spooky adventure is in development for Nintendo Switch. Okay, that's pretty cool. This makes me want to go back and play Luigi's Mansion. Tell me when it's coming out. Now, let's cover some upcoming games for Nintendo 3DS. Please take a look. And this is the part of the direct where I kind of zone out. Oh! Oh, is it a uh, Epic Yarn? Oh. That's awesome. I I love Kirby's Epic Yarn. It's so cute. What? Robots made of yarn. That's painful. That's pretty. That's pretty neat. Ooh. Got Oh, that's adorable. Let's have yarn Kirby for Smash. Here, here we go. Saying I want to see less Smash, and here I am. Wanting smash. Oh, wow. That's cool. Nice. Nice. Or destined to fail. And Boozer. It can only be Mario and Luigi Bowser's inside story. You gotta give him a heartburn or something. There's another side to every story. Even this one. Now you can go on Bowser Jr.'s journey as well. In his new adventure, That's a fat Goomba. find his own remedy for the blorps. But thanks to his signature selfishness, he ends up causing more problems than he cures. Better gather some allies and build up your very own army. That looks like a lot of fun. I think I don't think I played this one. I think Bowser's Inside Story was one that I skipped. Is Bowser Jr. destined for glorious kingship like his papa? Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story plus Bowser Jr.'s Journey releases on Nintendo 3DS January 11th. Very cool. Marwigi. A second player? Mar second player? I think Sidekick and I need to uh need to get a 3DS and play this with a capture device. Oh, that's neat. 
game. I figured they'd do something similar to like Mario 64 DS where it was uh, not necessarily Mario but a different Mario character. Maybe it could have been a Ghost Luigi from Smash! Again, with the Smash. Huh. Alright. Think zero. Luigi's Mansion will haunt Nintendo 3DS. Ooh, just in time for Halloween. Time for Halloween. And then they said it for me, or I said it for them. And played Yokai. Your is with the Red Cat Corps, Looks adorable, though. Watch Blasters, will let you team up I am with Team Eevee. <laughs> oh my! What did that? Oh. Oh wow. September 27th, which adds the Moon Rabbit Crew version to the title screen. Moon Rabbit Crew? Isn't that supposed to be about like ghosts or yokai monsters or something? Are there are there space monsters? New areas to explore. New yokai to befriend and new big boss yokai. Whoa. Why you ask? It's an astronaut yokai. <laughs> I am a part of the Ferret Squad. Moon Rabbit Crew. Moon Rabbit crew. Well, let's get to the Switch. Very well, thank you. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Snap. Signature. S more Sploon. Whoa. What the heck is going on in this trailer? Oh my god, it's an anime trailer. <laughs> That's awesome. Who who ups who's up for a Splatoon anime? Me! I'd watch it. It's totally an anime trailer. Look at this. This is incredible. I, okay, Nintendo, if uh, if th if you make a Zelda anime, you gotta make a Splatoon anime. I'm digging this song. 100X? What? I was really into Splatoon for a little while. I think, uh... I think I'm still good. Oh, new! What is that? New grenades. That's neat. Yeah, it wasn't until that's that's crazy. It wasn't until Spider-Man came out that I stopped playing. But good lord, it's just so weird. What is this? Is that is that a Psycho Mantis reference? Learn to version four. Sploon. I don't. I don't. I don't understand. So, do, do I have to like learn Splatoonies? Everyone's favorite blue robot. Mega Man. Return in Mega, Mega Man. Man. Oh my God. I played the demo. It's so good. I love it. I can't. I'm so excited. Um, bounce a lot of the balls. Bounce man. Formidable. Oh, that's that's so cool. I love how his armor changes now. That's such a. That that seems like it's taken after Mighty Number no. Nine. Oh my god. I gotta get that other Mega Man amiibo! <coughs> oh, wow. What? Okay. Oh, it's less than a month away. I should. Oh, hey, it's Birdo! 
What a good tranny. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's actually really neat. Petey! Some good characters. I love Birdo. Birdo's so good. It's so weird seeing a flying Koopa in a game. Ooh. Interesting. Look at that change up. Oh, wow. Okay. That's that's pretty cool that they're continuing to update their uh, their other games. Now, if only Arms got a better bigger update. What do we get? Oh, the Capcom beat 'em up bundle. Oh my God. Oh wow. Show me Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> Dang it! And so are these first -time home Whoa! I played that in the arcades! At least I think I did. It looks very familiar. I could be thinking of Metal Gear and I'm just an idiot. But it looks so familiar. Ooh. Oh! Wow! That looks so good. Oh my god, that's five days away. That's crazy. I was really hoping this wasn't a thing. Why? You know, I, I don't mean to be that guy. I like the game. Finally, they had Toadette. Holy crap. At least they're... What? 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 What is this? What is this madness? I don't know how I feel about that. That's 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 not what that raises so many questions. Um, why don't what instead of just doing Super Mario U? Why don't you just do the whole new Super Mario series as one bundle? That makes so much sense. I might be skipping that one. I don't know. Katamari! <laughs> Katamari Damacy! Oh my god! These games are so good! Oh my god. And now you better take control of the prince here. And that just roll and roll. We got to have Katamari for smash. Damn it, I can't get smash out of my head, man. Oh, this is so good. It's so cool. Why motion controls? Well, maybe it won't be so bad. Ah. Dude, this is... I'm... I'm getting it. I'm so excited now. That's... Yeah, that goes live, um, the 18th. Okay. Everybody enjoy your free... Free Nintendo Online Gaming for five more days. It's less than that for like four days. Why am I looking over here? They know what's over there. Let's see what's going on with this. Let's go explore porn on the internet on my Switch. Porn on my Switch. <laughs> Woohoo. Yeah. Okay, that's that's pretty cute. 
There are so many ways to have fun. A variety of games are supported. Rocket League. So find your favorites and take them online. Oh, uh, Overcooked. I really should try that. You can even play classic NES games. Anytime, anywhere. Oh, so you don't have to buy them. Get lost in the gameplay. Whether you're the boss or the little monster. For multiplayer games, each player can grab a Joy-Con controller. That, that's actually... Okay. I can, I can live with that. Hopefully, um, hopefully maybe this is a, uh, a replacement for the virtual console. Perhaps they're going to use like a Super Nintendo next and then N64, GameCube. That actually, that, that could be really cool. Luigi knows that no matter how careful you try to be, something unexpected can happen. Oh no. Why does everything happen bad, bad happen to Luigi? Here I'll Nintendo Switch online. Game save data is automatically don't, backed up in the Don't cloud. put it in his cloud. Even if your console breaks, <laughs> data will be safe from Oh home. my god. That's smartphone app. Okay. Nintendo Switch <laughs> also connects with a smartphone app. With this app, you can voice chat with friends while playing certain games. <laughs> why can't why can't we just voice chat on the console? That's can also join in the conversation. That way everyone's having fun. Okay, that that kind of makes sense cuz um me, Wes and a couple other friends play Overwatch over the phone, but still The service even has the ability to enhance certain games by connecting with them. Okay, that's That's all right. Sorry, I guess. Members will also receive special offers. What are they? have more to announce in the future when are you gonna announce them you got five days nintendo nintendo switch online the service begins september 18th think about which plan is right for you i mean for twenty dollars for accounts you can save some money with the family membership huh well we have one more thing Hey, uh, Breaker Arcade, are we still good for that, uh, <laughs> that account? <laughs> that family account? <laughs> Ooh! Please tell me you can slide those in! That'd be hilarious! Let's <laughs> see them slid into the console! I could probably just stick with the, uh... <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's so dumb looking. That's just a. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Now they're gonna get us with the uh, wireless Super Nintendo controllers and then N64 controllers and GameCube controllers. Oh, wait. They're already giving us GameCube controllers. Pokemon! Gotta catch them all! Get ready to set off on a Kanto region adventure with your very own partner Pokemon in Pokemon Let's Go Pokemon. Oh wow. And Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Today, we want to share a couple of things that you and your partner can enjoy in the upcoming game. During your adventure, I'm so excited. you'll come across obstacles blocking your path. When you do, you can rely on a secret technique to get past them. Oh. Are special skills that only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can use in the wild. So this is replacing HMs. Travel across water. That's adorable. Soar into the sky. I'm sorry, what? Furthermore, only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can learn certain powerful moves for use in battle. Plus, if you pet your partner while your Nintendo Switch is in handheld mode, you can change your partner's hairstyle. Depending on how you use the touch screen to pet it. That's adorable. That, that's cute. I don't care what anybody says. That's cute. I want to give my Eevee the swoop that I had. I'm debating on getting that just for those con for just for those controllers. Then again, if that Super Smash Bros. Switch is real, 
gates to the burning hells will open on an Oh, is this uh, Diablo? Yeah. We're talking about Diablo 3. Man, just thinking about this just means that Overwatch could be coming to the Switch. That's that's all I'm getting out of this. From the high heavens to the burning hell. That's that just makes me even more excited. Like I, I if that if that's real, I even greater spoils. Oh. Play as a demon hunter, barbarian, crusader, necromancer, Ganondorf. Monk or wizard with up to 3 friends online. I think uh Anybody out there who's uh, who's friends with me on the Nintendo Switch who's getting Diablo? Oh my god, that's cool. All amiibo figures are compatible, allowing you to summon a group of challenging enemies overflowing with sparkling goodies. Oh, okay. Diablo 3 Eternal Collection invades Nintendo Switch on November 2nd. That's pretty cool. We're making this party super. Can't wait. Souped up the Mario Party series with new types of gameplay on Nintendo Switch. Whoa, what? That look at all those characters. Controller and get your body grooving in soundstage. Or dive into the series' first four-player co-op mode, River Survival. Bet you've never played anything like Toad's Rec Room, which cleverly connects two systems. Huh. Oh, okay. That makes. Makes a if it isn't Mario. Specific dice blocks with alternate numbering, you can make a game changing comeback. You got a star. Every huh. mini game is brand new, all 80 of them. For a party of one, check out the new single player modes. Wait, there's a single player mode? Specific tasks on challenge road. Compete against players around the world. Huh. In the online Mario Thon mini game mode. Interesting. Festivities begin when Super Interesting. Mario Party launches October 5th. A new story in a village with a secret to hide. New uh, oh wow. Brand new RPG. Oh wow. Small village under the protection. They all look so cute. Except him. He looks like an egg. That is until the sudden appearance of monsters. Indeed. Can you catch them? Wait, the entire game takes place in this one place? When the situation calls for it, enlist the aid of fellow villagers to surmount powerful threats. What secret does the village harbor? Huh. Find out when town releases in 2019. That's interesting. Okay. It's kind of cool to see Game Freak work on something else other than Pokemon. Develop a city anytime, anywhere. Oh. I probably won't the pick this up. City building game city skylines is coming to Nintendo Switch. Ooh. A city in need oh no. Oh god, that looks so ah choppy. Ah. <laughs> Here I am saying that like graphics don't matter, but my god. I really hope the frame rate isn't that bad. I think that's my biggest problem is the frame rate looks so bad. Previously released downloadable content packs after Dark and Snowfall are included in the Nintendo Switch version. Yeah, I think I'm gonna skip that one. Wait, what? Okay. Evangelion, the video game. Dude, this looks so good. Oh. Oh my god, this game looks so good. During battle, you can exit your arsenal to explore the field on foot. What? Why would you want to do that when you have a giant? And your arsenal's abilities will be augmented as well. What the hell? Up to four players can join forces in online co-op to take down massive bosses. I 
I gotta get this. Giant robots? Better add DLC where I can take control of, uh... Dang. Take control of, uh... Giant monsters next. Yoshi. Yoshi! It's Yoshi! Yes! That's adorable. Whoa, that's... Oh. Why are you in a cupcake? Yoshi's in a cupcake! What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Miranda, we can play some Yoshi. Look at that. Look at that dinosaur. Tabletop gaming is a perfect fit for Nintendo Switch. And to prove it, oh my god. A leader in card and board games is bringing full adaptations of best selling tabletop games to the system. Huh. Build a medieval world in a full adaptation of the award-winning Carcassonne, complete with 3D maps, solo mode, four-player local multiplayer, and the game's famous expansions available as paid DLC. Whether you play alone or alongside a second player, forge a powerful deck and a fellowship of three to face... Okay, we're back. I had a problem. Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings. Okay. Lord of the Rings, the living card game. Stop the spread of four diseases and. Oh, pandemic. Okay. Multiplayer with pandemic. Plus, it's individually priced DLC based on popular expansions. Thanks to Asmodee, this is just the beginning for tabletop gaming on Nintendo Switch. Okay. For those of you who like board games. that even more is on the way. Including one of the most popular board games ever, Catan. Catan. A dungeon crawler based on Steve Jackson's iconic card game, Munchkin. Aww. Stay tuned. How bad can Munchkin be? All great creations, even nations, begin with a spark. Is this civilization? This doesn't look like it. Oh my god, I called it. All right, that's that's pretty cool. Can't wait to have Gandhi or wait, is that Gandhi? I think Gandhi nukes. Yeah. Yeah, have Gandhi nuke my my city on civilization on my Switch. <laughs> Man, I haven't played Civilization in a long time. How is it that looks like it runs better than s the other game? That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Starlink! Oh, I'm so hyped! This interplanetary adventure will push you and Fox McCloud to your limits. Let's be honest here. You guys need all the help you can get. Peppy, Falco, and Slippy will provide much needed backup in the new Nintendo Switch exclusive right. missions found only in Starlink Battle for Atlas. That's so cool. Star Fox, form up on me. Falco here, I got you covered. It's time to lock on. Do a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll. Star system. No matter who threatens to stop you. Wolves in the game? Oh my god. Ugh. Never thought I'd miss the food on Corneria. Falco tastes disgusting. <laughs> when Starlink Battle 
for Atlas takes flight October 16th. All right, that's that's pretty cool. Two more great RPGs are coming to Ooh, the world ends with you. The world ends with you. Final remix. I'm so excited. Called a new day, which contains a remixed map of Shibuya. So you'll really have to scramble to escape the area or face erasure. New monsters will appear as well, and so will the Reaper, Coco. The world ends with you. Final remix. Oh my God! I can't wait. Before then, guide a group of legendary warriors on a journey through the tragic history that doomed a kingdom and drove a hero down a dark path 500 years before the events of the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 game. Defend yourself from Malos and his forces. Okay. All the fury of this refined battle system, allowing you to fight as both the artificial life forms known as Blades and their masters, the Drivers. Newcomers will have the perfect place to start. When Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Torna, the Golden Country Where's the uh, or Shulk? Owners of the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 expansion pass can download this new content tomorrow. That's a week early. Wow. That's pretty cool. Store on Nintendo Switch and even more in store for the future. Join more than 38 million players for free to play co-op space ninja action when Warframe launches November 20th. Get down to Camila Cabello, Bruno Mars, Cardi B, and more anytime, anywhere. I'm gonna be like somebody's watching me. Get this crap off my screen. Ooh. Of matters, race as a team and win as a team in Team Sonic Racing. Launching this oh, Wednesday. that looks so good. The highest rated basketball Get this crap off my screen. No one cares. K19 is available now on Nintendo Switch. And get ready to jam in the sequel to the smash hit NBA arcade game, NBA 2K Playgrounds 2. Okay. I had fun with this one. Play as the Joker, Harley, Lex Luthor, and the rest of the best of the worst in the all new Lego DC Super Villains on October 16th. Ooh, Marky Mark's back. Final Fantasy comes to Nintendo Switch. Koopo. What? Final Fantasy Chronicles Remastered. 15 years after its debut, the co-op action RPG Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles is being remastered for Nintendo Switch. With the new online multiplayer mode, you and your friends can connect and adventure together. No link okay, that's ooh, that, that's pretty cool. New areas inside dungeons, so even returning fans can explore the unknown. Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition will launch in 2019. Wow. Way before that, <laughs> the experience the entire world and story of the latest entry in the core series. That's right. That's adorable. Pocket Edition HD launches later today on Nintendo eShop at What? Price. Holy crap, that's cool. A leveled up version of World of Final Fantasy is also on the way. What is this? This includes a new feature called Avatar Change. Look at that. Look at Cloud. It's a legendary characters from across the series storied history. Many fan favorites will show up in the world of Final Fantasy Maxima when it releases huh. on November 6th. <sighs> Excuse me. In addition, more Chocobo Dungeon is on the way. Chocobo! Final Fantasy Fables Chocobo's Dungeon returns in superior fashion. Now, it's adorable. And all the monsters. Not so just some of them. Joy-Con controllers, you can play cooperatively as well. Cool. Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon, everybody launches this winter. <laughs> Neat. Final Fantasy 12 is coming to Jeez, how many Final Fantasy games are coming out? Time battle system is a standout in the series, offering the ultimate in both freedom and strategy. This remaster comes loaded with a host of extra features, including a speed mode that lets you pick up the pace of your adventure. There's much to discover in the expansive world of Evilus, and now you can explore it on the couch or on the go. Wow. Final Fantasy 12: The Zodiac Age launches in 2019. Which reminds Is there any more? Later on, you'll also be able to enjoy these other classics and their iconic scenes anytime, anywhere. Final Fantasy 7, 9, and 10, 10 2 HD Remaster are coming to Nintendo Switch in 2019. 
Wow. Here's a bundle for the ultimate fan. The Smash Switch bundle's real. The Super Smash Brothers series, check this thing out. It's real. Oh my. Look at that. That is so cool. That also includes a download code for Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. There's no better way to show your love for the game. And the set also packs in something you'll want to get your hands on. The Joy-Cons are going to have the Smash logo. These Joy-Con controllers sport a new design as well. This Super Smash Brothers Ultimate bundle for the uh, Switch. The 2nd of November? Controller adapter in GameCube Controller Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Edition while supplies last. Keep looking over here. That's all the headlines. That's awesome. Oh man, now I have to make a choice. Do I want to get the game and the Pro Controller, or do I want to get the game and a new Switch? <laughs> or do I want to get the Pokemon one? Because I mean, Miranda likes the Switch. Shit, I think she, I think she needs her own. I think she needs her own. Animal Crossing. Look at that, Logan. I mean, not actual gameplay. Okay. Logan, I think uh, I think you got your Animal Crossing game. However, I think I'm going to get bamboozled. I think this is a Smash reveal. gonna be a smash reveal isn't it and it could be either or letter it's a smash reveal it's a smash reveal it's it's calling back to the to the first trailer with the villager for Wii U it's it's got to be smash I called it! <laughs> Alright, cool. Well, there you go, guys. Isabelle's in Smash. Oh, my God. Look at how cute she is. She's adorable. She looks like she plays just about the same as Villager. All right, okay, I can get behind that. I mean, I probably won't play as you, but that's cool. I guess, is there any more? Was Tom Nook and Tom Nook's gonna be an Echo Fighter? There's going to be... <laughs> Smashing. <laughs> Becky. There's a new Animal Crossing for Switch. Is that it? <laughs> well, look at that! Logan, you got your game, buddy. Sweet. Okay, well, that was the Nintendo Direct for the 13th. Um, wow, there was a lot to lot to see, a lot of new stuff that was announced. We got Samur Yoshi playing that backwards. That's crazy. Animal Crossing, new Luigi's Mansion, 
more of the demon x machina bull crap that was a good direct i'm i'm happy they kind of they stayed away from smash for the most part that bundle looks good now i gotta decide if i want to get the pokemon bundle or the smash bundle although that smash pro controller looks a lot better sort of I mean, the Switch, I don't know. I don't know. I really liked it. Um, for the 3DS games, obviously, that's not going to be my thing. I don't play a lot of 3DS. I don't even have a 3DS anymore. Um, but everything that I saw looks pretty good, and I'm excited. Um, the fact that that Smash Bundle's coming out earlier is kind of odd. So I wonder how they're going to do that. Maybe, maybe by accident, people get to play Smash early. But what do I know? I'm, I'm really kind of looking forward to how uh that super mario game or super mario party game plays uh I, I think the one thing that i was disappointed in is that super mario bros wii u is coming to the switch the games are fine but i think if they wanted to do something in that vein they probably should have ported all i think four games there are now four or five in that series to the switch I probably won't pick it up again, but nevertheless, that, uh, that'd be a cool game to play for people who have never played it or whoever had a Wii U. Um, but yeah, and, and the online comes out in a few days. That's exciting too. And seeing there's an NES controller that you can use, uh, if you pay the bundle or if you pay for the full thing, you get, um, brrr get access to this entire this huge library of nes games and i'm kind of expecting to see that super nintendo is going to come up next time or we're going to follow this up with super nintendo n64 and maybe even gamecube and wii that would be really cool so nintendo if you're going to do that please make it happen um i really want to play a bunch of my old uh gamecube games on my switch that would be so much fun and you have you it has gamecube controller support so why wouldn't you do it that's that's just my thing and isabel for smash not necessarily my thing i'm not a big animal crossing fan but that's pretty cool to see that there we got a different character represent a uh, new character representing another franchise that honestly is lacking besides having you know i mean the animal crossing only has one character in the in smash but that's pretty cool i was kind of expecting maybe a pokemon rep or another echo fighter but there's always next time um speaking of next time that's all i have to say on this switch direct if you guys are excited for a game let me know what game you're excited for in the comment section below other than smash um and Smash related, who do you think is going to be in the next Smash Brothers, whether it be Echo Fighter or new character? And with that all being said, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Uh, sorry I haven't been uploading. I'm going to have an explanation video coming soon. Uh, but in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful evening and take care.